Hi, it's Hayden from Bud. I'm gonna walk you through how to measure a shirt you already like the fit of in order to find your perfect fit on our Made to Measure program. So first of all, what you're gonna need is a tape measure and a shirt. Now, for collar size, a lot of shirts will have the size in already, but it's still important to measure the actual collar size, purely because some places will allow for shrinkage and some places won't. And if you've already washed the shirt a couple of times and like how it fits now, it might be a different measurement. So for us, we cut to allow for some shrinkage in the collar. So it's important to look at where you're going. Here, I'm measuring from the button to the center of the buttonhole. Now, this shirt hasn't been washed before, so when it does wash, it will shrink to 15 inches, but it measures 15 and a quarter at the moment. So next we're gonna move on to the sleeve measurement. The best way to do this is to find the center point of the shirt. Some shirts will have a, a line in the center just to show the panel. Um, others won't, so it's important to try and find the midpoint of the collar. It might help to measure the full collar and find the center point. Um, so here, when laid flat, you're looking about eight and a quarter. So then you want to grab your measuring tape and put it just to that centre line and against the collar. Take it down to the shoulder and then take it down to the sleeve. Now, this is one of our stock shirts um, that we haven't washed yet. So normally they measure 34 once they've been washed, but this is measuring just about 34 and a quarter because it hasn't been washed because we allow for shrinkage. Not all companies do, so it's important to take a look at this and if you have already washed it and you like how it fits, that's the measurement. But if it's one that you haven't washed before and have only one maybe once, um, again, just think about whether or not it's got that shrinkage in. Next, we're gonna measure the chest measurement of the shirt. Um, now, the best way to do this is to make sure your shirt is buttoned up um, and that you can get to both armpits pulled out because what we're gonna do is just take this end of the tape measure, bring it right down, and you want them right under the armpits. That'll give you the good chest measurement. Now, you've got to remember the shirt is in half here. So it measures 24 inches. You've got to double that in order to get the correct measurement. So this will be a 44 inch chest um, and a 15 collar and a 34 inch sleeve. The next measurement you're gonna need is gonna be the waist. Very similar to the chest measurement, you're gonna find about five buttons down. So that's one, two, three, four, five. I'll pop your tape measure in line with that and measure across. And this measures 22, so you're looking at a 44 inch waist. 